Hey YouTubers, I got a video review for everybody here. This is a Amana AMCV96 furnace. We had this installed by a company called AirServe. They're a national installer, installation, maintenance, service, repair, you name it. Um, they do duct work cleaning, I'm assuming, at some of their locations as well. Um, we had them install this. This was about $3,975 all total. Uh, Condensate pump and air filter there were included. That's a 16 by 25 by 5 inch air filter. It's a MERV 11. Uh, can be converted to an electric air cleaner. Uh, now, this is a two stage variable blower and inducer 60,000 BTU furnace. And it's currently running in high mode because it's chilly out and it's just calling for more heat. Now, it's hooked up to my Vantage Pro 8000 in my other video. and you can see that this when they put it in it's a little shorter and I don't have the matching coil or AC unit for it yet but that's our next year install so I'm gonna have them come back out and top off the AC for us just for this coming se summer season and then uh, we're gonna get the I think it's the ASXC or backwards or something like that but it's a matching coil for this furnace and uh, unit because it's also Energy Star um, now this thing runs in single stage a lot of the time. I've got it turned on on the programmable thermostat right now. It's on a permanent hold to hold it at 68 degrees in the house and it keeps the house perfect. We don't have any problems. Now this is an older home, needs a little more insulation work done here and there, but it's still keeping the house, you know, right there where we want it and it's just really good. So one thing I'll quickly mention is the warranties on the Amanas and uh, I believe the Goodman and the Daikin are all the same or similar warranty. It has a 10 year parts warranty on it, lifetime unit replacement to where if the heat exchanger ever goes bad for the life of the homeowner, which I believe it's transferable as well, the furnace gets replaced, not the heat exchanger, the whole unit. So. That's one thing we went with the Amana. Plus, AirServe has some of their own warranties, which are really good. They've, you'd have to look them up, but they have a lot of their own good warranties, too. They've got some that, you know, they're customer-oriented big time. So, I'll walk around this real quick here. Uh, some of this was already previously here. Uh, they added some of it and, you know, sealed up stuff. This is Scylla Seal, aluminum-colored silicone caulk. They just ran their fingers down it and that. I'm not worried about stuff like this. But the point is it got sealed up. I'm gonna buy me some more for the rest of the stuff around the house. Kind of same pumps are running. Other than that, that's pretty much it. I've never seen any real reviews on these except for someone having a problem. So if anybody's got any comments or questions, do let me know, I'll answer them, no problem. And uh, that's currently the temperature in the basement, which is not really heated. But the uh, humidity, the top one there, that's pretty much about what I'm getting all the time because, you know, it used to be pretty high down here, about 80% humidity. So it does a pretty good job at drying it up a little bit. So do let me know if you guys got any comments or questions, and then I'll, you know, like I said, I'll answer them no problem. Anyways, thanks for watching. Please like, subscribe, have a good one, and don't work too hard. Bye.